These messages are for my air signs, Aquarius, Libra, uh, Gemini for the month of mid-November um, for love and romance. So um, take what messages resonate and leave what doesn't. And not going to resonate with um, every air sign out there. Um, so let's see what's going on with your person here. Love and relationships. For air signs, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Okay. Hope everyone's doing well today on their Sunday. Mid-November messages for air signs. You've already got them falling out here. All right. Let's see what's going on. We have a teacher, counselor, or social worker. Okay, what's going on here, um, air signs? They feel like uh, your person feels like you're um, helping them in some way. Um, they're learning something new. Maybe they could be reaching out to get some help in a certain situation or within your relationship here, asking for guidance, okay? We have, I'm falling in love with you. So um, I do feel like... If, if you're not sure that your person loves you, that yeah, they are falling in love for you. There is deep feelings there. Okay, we do have third party situations. So yeah, I do feel like there was um, some involvement here, whether it had to do with a, a teacher, counselor, uh, being the third party or other people involved in your situation here, um, giving advice that they were listening to and probably was not very good advice at the time, okay? We do have attention, so I feel like your person right now is kind of looking for attention or wanting attention, or attention just could have been an issue in your relationship here. And you have control freaks, so uh, I do feel like your person either uh, wants to take control of this situation or they're used to having control and they feel like that they're not in control right now, okay? We have, I was just not ready to commit yet. So I feel like yeah, also your person here uh, was having commit committal issues. They were non-committal. They wanted to be single. This is the single life for them. They just wanted to play around um, this attention, go out and be a player. And um, they weren't serious. They didn't understand um, possibly what actual love was. You know, they just... Um, uh, never really had this type of a relationship or connection before, okay? We do have true love here. So, yeah, they, your person feels like this is true love to them. Like I said, they've never had a type of connection like this before. Air Signs says, you are the only one for me. I don't want to be with anyone else. So, yeah, I feel like that um, possibly whatever happened in your love situation here has affected your person. And um, they don't want to be with anybody else. It's kind of given them a wake-up call, okay, in this situation. We have a uh, cheat and fidelity. I do feel like that attention, they were a player. Um, there was some cheating or there was a reason to believe that there was some type of infidelity due to the third party situation and um, the attention here, okay? Uh, we do have surrender. So um, surrender to um, the divine source, surrender to God. Um, possibly this is a him, him or her take as they resonate here, air signs, that it's time to surrender this situation, that there might not be um, any more for, forward movement, okay? There's just nothing more that you could do in this situation um, if you want to continue. I I don't know if this person is continuing with attention and cheating and infidelity and continuing these third-party situations, but um, they're asking you to surrender here. Can you see things from my point of view? So um, possibly putting yourself in the other person's shoes. Yeah, just um, a lot of communication and listening to your person. Listen to their side of the situation. Have them listen into your side of the situation. Being open and being vulnerable with each other, okay? says, I don't know how to love you the way that you deserve to be loved. Like I said, your person is, this is true love. They've never had a type of love like this before, and it's confusing to them. And they're reaching out to other people asking what to do because they're unsure of themselves. They've been a player for probably most of their life here, um, air signs. And that's all that they have known. They've never had a relationship that was quite like yours because you guys are beautiful and amazing and graceful 
and you're balanced and you demand truth and honesty and clarity. It says, I can't control myself when we are together. So I feel like there's a lot of passion here. Um, like I said, this control freak, they're used to being in control of situations. And when they're around you, they feel like that you are you have power over them, that you have control over them. Okay. Uh, this this longing for you is intense. So yeah, I feel like they're um they're having issue right now because they really want to be with you and there's obstacles in the way and they're not able um to get to you and get that attention, that longing. Um I do feel like that they do want to um be intimate with you also. So be aware of that. I am really bad with words. I can't seem to find the right words to say to you. So yeah, I feel like there is a lot of um, emotional traumas here um, with relationships that they can't seem to find the right words to say to you. They don't, um, they don't know how to express their feelings of love, okay? Their language is different than yours. It says you give me a purpose. So uh, uh, I, I just feel like this person doesn't realize that they are the purpose. That your person feels like that this is codependency, that they need to depend on you for a purpose. That's a codependency issue. You are you have your own purchase purpose. Each individual person does, and uh, where you want to go and what you want to do with your life, and to have other people have control over that is uh, disturbing here. Okay. So you have so many things remind me of you and us. So yeah, I do feel like there's a lot of reminiscing, um, looking over memories, past photos, videos, whatever you guys had together, um, any type of vacations that you took that they're looking back on things and, you know, um, wishing things were different, wishing they can go back and take things back and start all over again, okay? We do have chemistry here, like I said, to be careful because they do want to be with you in that type of way, okay? It says... I want you, I want to conquer you. So yeah, I feel like this control issue, they want to take control over you. So just be aware you're, you're in control of your own life there. Um, you don't need to have anybody else, um, telling you what to do or what to say or how to act because you're your own person and you have every right to, um, express yourself in that way without being judged or controlled. Okay. You do have unfinished business, so I do feel like uh, air signs your person feels like they are, will be coming back around if they haven't already come back around again. And there was mixed signals in this situation here. Possibly September could be significant. Something happened in September. They do feel like you're hard to resist. So yeah, I do, uh, they feel they're coming for you here. There's a lot of desires, a lot of desires, and they really want your forgiveness. They do. So um. The long distance and driving them nuts. They can't take it no more. So, and we do have player. Oh, warning. There's a player. Just be careful. Watch you don't get taken for granted, okay? Remember, you have you have the choice. This is your choice. Okay. Let's get some positive messages for you. Not just for your um the person love and rela relationship that you're dealing with. This is just for you, for your empowerment, for your self-esteem, okay? Because you are amazing air signs. All right. I got to be quick here. I don't know when my video is going to stop, so Okay, life is tough, but so are you. So yeah, it's asking you to be tough, be strong, um, hold your hold your ground, and um, stand. Um, can't even think of the word right now. <laughs> um, your barriers, you know, what you will tolerate and what you will not tolerate. Love is always the answer. So remember that to um, exert yourself out in a kind and loving way. Um, be compassionate, be empathetic. You know, you know, we don't know each um, an, another situation unless we are in their shoes. Okay. Like they said, can you see things from my point of view? It says I will let go of toxic and negative thoughts. So you need to be letting go of these toxic and negative thoughts right now. Okay. Worrying about this situation because worry is a wasted emotion. It's just causing you more stress and affecting your health. Okay. My thoughts are filled with positivity and my life is full of prosperity. And this is what you be, should be saying to yourself. Your thoughts, you're getting rid of the toxicity and the negativity and you're filling it with positive and prosperity. 
Okay, Air Signs, I hope these messages help for you. Like I said, they won't resonate with everyone. And if you want to set up a uh, reading with me, I do a lot of different readings here. Um, just like